cash in deposits. I maneuver on some cash in the South Street. Run the clock and tell me nothing. All right, what's up, people? So we are here at the studio, and I have an hour and a half this time, and I have my Pentax, and we're gonna shoot Cinesteel 800 T. Uh, I'm not quite sure how this is gonna come out because originally I had a whole shoot planned out. That person got food poisoning, so she couldn't come. So therefore, had to make some changes, and we're gonna see how it comes out. Credit card just up the max, and everything I do, I tax is hard to buy my time. They see me shining, my paint dripping, I'm acting different. I keep it modest till I turn up, I've been champagne sipping. They clock watch while I big boss in a floss and proper. I'm quick to slide like a slip, not ducking cops and robbers. Been on the wave, you can't tame, they press and play to play me. And I'm out of body, my vibration high, I'm levitating. I feel amazing, I'm keeping space away from them toxins. I'm going places, I'm gassed up, ain't no limitation. Headed where that tree in that weather, got my melanin popping. Whip with the leather, the softest. What a fuck a humble brag. I'm bad. Boy with that cash ready to spaz I splash the dash digital rap They mad is trying bite too hot to handle I ghost ride it I pilot phantom My mind ain't yet hit its prime They ask me when I'm quitting Decline the answer I'm unbothered I'm kind man it But fuck a body in the way Cause I've been moving at a rate where any day The fuse gon' burn out then I blow up Then we go up tell a hater so what It's in my veins I'm cut No idea how this is gonna turn out This is really just a backup camera to try to fix it. Not a backup camera, but a backup shoot. Just kind of fix what happened to compensate for it. Oh, blooded in function, I'm flawless, I'm manufactured different They carbon copy, they sloppy, I'm everlasting with it I'm legendary, it's very scary, I'm seeing it through the finish I'm on it, talking flat right, So I'll swap back and forth between the 90mm and the, I believe that's the 45 I'll fix it right here Whichever one, that one, and the waist level viewfinder Because, I don't know, I'm feeling kind of uncomfortable about how these gonna turn out if you saw me shooting with another camera, I'm not gonna say what it is just yet until the end of it because that one's pissing me off too. So it's really just one of those days where it ain't working, but we still gonna make it work. So we're gonna get something out of this. I just don't know what. Trying to get my little video removed. <laughs> Hella quick. <laughs> Fooling me. Let her do her thing, cause I can't tell her mama who to be. Girl, that's rude to me. And if she wanna swing that Lexus down to Texas, know that I'm gonna let her. What the fuck I look like tripping? I got polo on my sweater. Give a fuck about all that gossip, cause them don't know no better. I'm my on and popping till I can't fold up no more cheddar. What they mad at me for? Cause I'm out here stunting like my daddy. I post with all my Negroes. I'ma drop that pen, I'ma send that Addy. Play his front of me, don't roll no me. What the fuck you thought? What's up, people? It's been a while. It's been probably two weeks since I shot this film. Life has been crazy. A lot of stuff been coming at me. But anyway, if you made it this far throughout this video and you have not subscribed, what are you doing? Go ahead and do that now. Also, if you made it this far and you haven't liked the video, go ahead and do that now. Really appreciate it. Now, while y'all do that, I'm going to sip some more tea. This is stress relief. Um, yeah, I'm waiting for y'all to subscribe. I'm like, all right, you did that? Appreciate it. Okay, so let's talk about this Cinesteel 800. This is a very unique film. It's called Cinesteel because it's made from the same, I guess you'll call film quality or film standards that they use in Hollywood, hence Cinesteel. 
the thing about this film is it has a halation type vibe to it which is like it makes the colors that have lights on them or it makes light really really so it has a glow and a cinematic feel to it which is something that i'm really really a fan of and the 800 means that that's how sensitive it is to light so this can be used for indoor shoes just like i did this day and the t means tungsten now as far as what tungsten is I think that's the way or just certain type of lights are called tungsten. You probably have to Google that because I don't want to lie to you. Anyway, I shot the film. I like it. I love it. Hope you guys liked it. Um, I, I saw that there was a lot that can be done with this. I was afraid that I was really, really underexposing it, but apparently not. And I'm going to give you a little bit of backstory about this shoot. Like I said, originally the, the lady who was supposed to shot got food poisoning. So I had to find somebody at the last minute and Destiny came through in the clutch for me. So shout out to Destiny. Julio just happened to be in my neighborhood on that same day. He hit me up and was like, bro, what you got going? I was like, actually, I'm getting ready to go shoot. Let's go. So he put the wardrobe together. Destiny came, we shot, boom. Now, a lot of things didn't really go the way it was supposed to because it's life. However, we made it work. All right, so if you guys noticed at the beginning of the video, I used another camera to get some test shots, and that was the Fujifilm GFX 50R, which is a medium format camera that is digital. But this vlog isn't about this. This vlog is about Cinestill 800. So, had to test it out. Figured I'd get some test shots with it. But the reason of me using this camera before I shot the film camera was to make sure that I didn't waste any of the film that I had. So that's why I used that. It wasn't a specific reason other than that. I also like the way those pictures came out too. But anyway, will I be using this film again? Yes. Although I will be a lot more creative next time with this film. I feel like this isn't, this is just my personal opinion. I don't think this is something that you could just, or should just, or something I would use to just shoot around with and play around with. No, I feel like this is something I would use to be very very creative and do something special with i wouldn't just use it as an everyday film that's just my opinion however i do like it do love it we'll use it again and as far as my favorite picture from this shoot i would have to say hmm i don't know i really like this picture right here it just kind of speaks to me for some reason it gives me true editorial vibes kind of like almost Almost like a movie, but not like a movie still. It's almost, almost, slight vibes. Now, which one of these pictures is your guys' favorite? What do you guys think about the Cinestill 800? Would you buy it? Would you be willing to try it out? And I will see you guys next time. And hopefully, y'all go shoot something. Y'all get out the house and y'all try some stuff. Let's get it.